This is code.org. I'm currently working on CS principles. I'm on unit three, intro to programming, lesson eight, creating function and parameters, part four, defining functions with parameters. This time you're going to write your own function with parameters com to complete an image. Two function calls to draw, triangle, have been placed at the top of your program, but the function itself needs to be defined. The program should draw this. Ah, triangles. <laughs> Makes sense. Do this. Complete the function definition for draw triangle side length. Notice that you've already been given a description, a descriptive and meaningful parameter name, side length, but you can change it if you wish. Hint, I love hints. You should put your pin down and pick it up as part of the definition of draw triangle. That way, you guarantee that a call to draw triangle will always actually draw. Picking up the pin, picking up, picking the pin up as the last act of your function is a nice thing to do for anyone other, for any other code that might not be expecting draw triangle to have side effects, uh, to have a side effect of putting the pin down. As a reminder of how parameters within the function of how to use a parameter within the function, here is the correct version of draw size for reference. Yep, and that's what we just got last time, right? Size, 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 size. All right, so let's see what we got. We start with this empty draw triangle function, and side length is our parameter. So I know we need to move forward, but how much do we want to move forward? Well, apparently one should have a hundred uh, draw triangle, a hundred length side, and the other 150 pixel length side. Well, how can we change that? Use the parameter name. If I make this side length, whatever, when I run our function, whatever I, it is, when I run it, that's what, whatever this number is, it's a hundred. So when I run our function, Side length's 100, and so I'll move forward 100. This time when I ask the function to run, it's going to look through the code, find draw triangle, and run it with side length being 150. All right, so that we got. Now, let's do turn left. Hmm. All right, I'm going to make a new function because I don't want to have to write move forward turn three times. I'm going to make a function called draw side. And it needs a parameter. Dang it. So this one. side length, that. And then I want to have a function call here to draw side. Side length. So we only draw one side so far. So, but up, draw side, side length, Draw side, side length. All right, I need you to understand what I am doing. So, what's happening here is that we are right here, pen up, move to, the turtle moves at that point, and then this function's called, draw triangle's called. The computer looks around, here it is, side length is equal to 100. So then it pen down, and now I call this function draw side. Oh, draw side, uh, side length. Uh, side length was equal 100. So 100. Boop, draw side is run. Side length, uh, side length, side length, side length, uh, 100. 100. So I move forward 100. I turn left 120. Zoop. 
go back down to the next function, run that again, and again. I should draw all three sides. We'll find out. Ta-da! And that looks like theirs. Oh, that one was tough. So if you don't understand this code, pause it, go back, and listen to me explain this. It's going to get so hard. But this stuff is really important, and it's really good to understand. Right? We have multiple functions here. We have a draw side function. We have a draw, a draw triangle function. That call, right? We have nested functions. You could call it. That's not what they do usually, though. But anyways. And then we have parameter, side length. And side length's used here, and it's passed. Uh, uh, it's used, and then it's also used down here, right? So this function is called. It then calls side draw side. It references side length, side length, which is put in here as the argument, as the parameter value. Go rewatch this if you're stuck. You really need to get this. Let's keep uh, going.